So our research is establishing a baseline of the health and behavior of many of these species of whales so that into the future, uh, we can better inform management and conservation uh, of all whales in the Antarctic Peninsula. We're on our way to meet up with the whale team and see if we can go find some whales today. During our first trip to Antarctica in 2018, we learned a lot about whales. They make their way to Antarctica during the summer months, typically between November and March, and their journey can cover thousands of miles, but it's all worth it. The nutrient-rich waters are abundant with krill, a small shrimp-like creature that forms the base of the Antarctic food web. Krill is a primary food source for many whale species and is high in protein and essential fatty acids. Pretty crazy to think that the biggest mammals on Earth survive on one of the smallest. Lauren and Blake have come here to Western Antarctica because it is one of the most populated whale habitats on the planet. 